Welcome to Ms. Pam Reads. Today we are reading Dory's story from the movie Finding Dory. Dory's story by Bill Scollin. Illustrated by the Disney Storybook Art Team. Oh, that was more than one person, a whole bunch of people. Dory is a little fish. She has trouble with her memory. Dory does not remember how to get home. She is lost. She asks everyone she meets for help. No one knows where Dory lives. Dory becomes friends with Nemo and Marlin. They all live together in a coral reef. One day, Dory remembers a place called the Jewel of Morro Bay. Maybe her home is there. Dory crosses the ocean with Nemo and Marlin to find her home. She gets stuck in a plastic ring. Dory gets taken to the Jewel of Morro Bay. It is a big aquarium. Nemo and Marlin want to find Dory. A bird carries them into the aquarium. Dory meets an octopus. His name is Hank. He helps Dory figure out where her parents live. Dory finds her home. Her parents are gone. A crab says they went to the hospital. The pipes will take Dory to the hospital. Destiny is a whale shark. Bailey is a beluga. They show Dory the way. Nemo and Marlin find Dory in the pipe. They swim off together to find Dory's parents. Dory's parents are not at the fish hospital. Hmm. Dory falls down a drain. The drain drops her into the ocean. Dory is alone. She follows a shell path. It leads her to her parents. Nemo and Marlin are on a truck with the hospital fish. Dory will save them. Becky helps rescue Nemo and Marlin. Dory is still in the truck. Oh my. Hank scares the truck driver away. They drive off the pier into the ocean. The fish are happy to return to the sea. Destiny and Bailey join them. Dory's parents go back to the reef with Dory and her friends. They are all one big happy family. The end. Thank you for joining me for Miss Pam Reads. Remember to subscribe to the channel so you'll get an update when a new story posts. Bye.